I think I messed up. Wait, I'm sure I did. Welcome to Young Elder TV, where UFOs, religions, Anunnaki, and black youth collide in a cosmic comedy. Meet Marcus, our fearless leader. He's an aspiring scientist and part-time alien enthusiast. Then there's Maya, his sister, a no-nonsense lawyer who secretly believes in ancient astronauts. Oh, and don't forget Grandma Pearl. She swears she had tea with an alien once. And finally, their quirky neighbor, Mr. Thompson, convinced he's a reincarnated god. With three million fans already hooked, Young Elder TV blends laughs with galactic mysteries. Ready to join the fun? Hit that subscribe button and dive into the cosmic chaos. Young Elder TV, where the stars align for comedy. Energy. It's the invisible force that drives the universe from the smallest atom to the largest star. We'll explore its many forms and uncover the profound ways it shapes our reality. Imagine a universe frozen in time, devoid of life and change. Every atom vibrates, every planet orbits, every galaxy spins. From the gentle sway of a tree to the explosive power of a supernova, energy manifests in countless ways. It's about the potential for motion, the stored energy waiting to be unleashed. Our journey begins in the realm of atoms, the building blocks of matter. Electrons whirl around a nucleus driven by electromagnetic energy. Zooming out, we encounter molecules bound by chemical energy and stars fueled by nuclear energy. These celestial giants convert mass into energy, releasing light and heat that bathe the cosmos. Look around you, everyday objects exist in one of the three states of matter, solid, liquid or gas. A solid holds its shape with tightly packed molecules. Liquids are more fluid, adapting to their surroundings. Gases fill any space they occupy, expanding and contracting with ease. Imagine the air we breathe, a mixture of gases essential for life. Gas molecules move rapidly, creating pressure and filling their container. To understand the states of matter, we need to peer into the microscopic world of atoms and molecules. In a solid, molecules are tightly packed, vibrating in place. Heating a solid adds energy, making molecules vibrate faster until they transition to a liquid. Heating a liquid further increases molecular movement, leading to the gas phase. Now, the molecules are free, filling the entire space. The transitions between solid, liquid and gas occur over a range of temperatures. At the melting point, ice coexists with water in a dynamic equilibrium. These transformations are driven by changes in temperature and pressure. Solid, liquid and gas are not the only states of matter. Plasma, a superheated ionized gas, is found in stars and lightning. Bose-Einstein condensates, created by cooling atoms to near absolute zero, behave as a single entity. Dark matter and dark energy hint at a universe far stranger than we imagined. Imagine shrinking down to the size of an atom, witnessing the dance of molecules. In a solid, molecules vibrate in place, giving solids their rigidity. As temperature rises, molecules in a solid vibrate faster, transitioning to a liquid. In a liquid, molecules move more freely, slipping past each other. In the gas phase, molecules whirl and collide with abandon. Temperature dictates the pace of molecular motion. In a solid, increasing temperature makes molecules vibrate faster, transitioning to a liquid. In a liquid, higher temperatures make molecules move more chaotically. In the gas phase, molecules reach the peak of their kinetic frenzy. The higher the temperature, the faster they move, colliding with greater force. Every molecule vibrates at specific frequencies like a finely tuned instrument. These vibrations play a crucial role in how matter interacts with light. A red apple absorbs all colors except red, which it reflects. Vibrational frequencies extend beyond the visible spectrum, affecting how we study the world.
Our eyes are limited to a narrow band of the electromagnetic spectrum. Infrared radiation excites molecular vibrations perceived as heat. Microwave ovens exploit the vibrational frequencies of water molecules. Radio waves interact with molecules in interstellar space, revealing secrets of distant stars. From birth, we are bound to Earth by gravity. Gravity holds planets in orbit, governs galaxies, and dictates tides. Despite its elusiveness, gravity's influence is undeniable. It's the reason we can stand on the ground and why objects fall to Earth. Imagine a world without electricity. Electricity powers our homes and cities, driven by the flow of charged particles. Electrons flow from higher to lower electrical potential, creating an electric current. This flow powers everything from light bulbs to supercomputers. Deep within atoms, the nucleus holds unimaginable energy. Nuclear energy arises from the forces binding the nucleus, released in fission or fusion. Nuclear fission powers plants and bombs with vast energy potential and significant risks. Heat, that invisible flow of thermal energy, is a constant presence in our lives. From the warmth of the sun on our skin to the heat we feel from a roaring fire, it's a fundamental aspect of the universe, intimately connected to the motion of atoms and molecules. Thermal energy, also known as internal energy, is the energy associated with the random motion of particles within a system. The faster these particles move, the higher the system's temperature and the greater its thermal energy. Heat can be transferred in three ways, conduction, convection and radiation. Conduction is the transfer of heat through direct contact, like when you touch a hot stove. Convection is the transfer of heat through the movement of fluids, like the rising of hot air in a room. Radiation is the transfer of heat through electromagnetic waves, like the warmth we feel from the sun. From the moment you wake up and stretch to the bounce of a basketball on the court, elasticity plays a crucial role in our everyday lives. This remarkable property of certain materials allows them to deform under stress and then return to their original shape when the stress is removed. Elastic energy is the energy stored in a material when it's stretched, compressed or otherwise deformed. Think of a stretched rubber band, a compressed spring or a bent diving board. These objects store potential energy in their deformed state, ready to be released when the deforming force is removed. This stored energy can be harnessed to do work, powering everything from simple toys to complex machines. Elastic materials are used in a wide range of applications, from shock absorbers in cars to surgical implants in the human body. As we delve deeper into the realm of energy, we encounter a realm where the familiar laws of physics seem to bend and blur, the quantum realm. Here, energy exists in discrete packets, or quanta, governed by the enigmatic laws of quantum mechanics. Particles can exist in multiple states at once, and observation can influence outcomes. Zero-point energy, a sea of fluctuating energy, exists even in the vacuum of space. Quantum entanglement links particles, their fates intertwined, defying classical physics. This spooky action at a distance could revolutionize computing and communication. Einstein's theory of relativity, a cornerstone of modern physics, sets a seemingly insurmountable speed limit for the universe, the speed of light. Nothing, according to this theory, can travel faster than light, a cosmic speed trap that governs the flow of time and the interactions of matter and energy. Yet the human imagination, ever restless, has long been captivated by the possibility of breaking this cosmic barrier of traveling faster than light and unlocking the secrets of the universe. This pursuit has led to the theoretical exploration of particles that exist beyond the light barrier, particles known as tachyons. Tachyons, if they exist, would inhabit a strange realm of physics where time flows backward, cause and effect are reversed, and the very fabric of space-time is warped and twisted. While their existence remains purely hypothetical, the search for tachyons continues, driven by the insatiable human desire to push the boundaries of knowledge and explore the universe's most profound mysteries. Time, that relentless river flowing from past to present to future, has long been a source of fascination and frustration. 
We experience its passage as an inexorable march, a one-way street from birth to death. But what if we could manipulate time, bend it to our will, or even travel through it? The concept of time travel, once relegated to the realm of science fiction, has become a subject of serious scientific inquiry fueled by our growing understanding of the universe and the bizarre implications of Einstein's theories of relativity. These theories suggest that time is not absolute but relative, its passage influenced by gravity and motion. This malleability of time opens up the tantalizing possibility of manipulating it, perhaps through the harnessing of exotic forms of energy. Some theories suggest that wormholes, hypothetical tunnels through space-time, could be created or stabilized by harnessing energy fields of unimaginable power, allowing for shortcuts through the cosmos and even journeys through time itself. In the mirror world of antimatter, everything is reversed, though. For every particle of matter, there exists an antiparticle with the same mass but opposite charge. When matter and antimatter meet, they annihilate each other in a burst of pure energy, a process that holds both immense destructive potential and the promise of unparalleled power. Antimatter is not merely a theoretical construct, it has been created and studied in laboratories, albeit in minuscule quantities. Its creation requires enormous amounts of energy and its containment poses significant challenges as even the slightest contact with matter results in annihilation. Despite these challenges, the allure of antimatter is undeniable. Its potential as a fuel source is unmatched as the annihilation of a small amount of antimatter with an equal amount of matter releases vastly more energy than any chemical reaction. Antimatter-powered spacecraft, if they could be built, could travel to the stars at a fraction of the speed of light, opening up the cosmos to human exploration. In the grand tapestry of the cosmos, life emerges as a dazzling anomaly, a symphony of complexity and order arising from the chaos of the inanimate. At the heart of this remarkable phenomenon lies energy, the invisible force that animates every living cell powering the intricate machinery of life from the smallest bacterium to the largest whale. From the moment of conception when a single fertilized egg embarks on its journey to become a complex organism, energy is paramount. Every cell division, every biochemical reaction, every heartbeat and every breath is a testament to the ceaseless flow of energy that sustains life. The primary source of this life-giving energy is the Sun, a celestial powerhouse that bathes our planet in a constant stream of light and heat. Through the miracle of photosynthesis, plants, algae and some bacteria capture this radiant energy and convert it into chemical energy, stored in the bonds of sugars and other organic molecules. These energy-rich molecules then serve as fuel for virtually all life on Earth, either directly when consumed by herbivores or indirectly when carnivores prey on herbivores. Beyond life, energy orchestrates a cosmic ballet of breathtaking scale. From star births to supernovae, energy shapes our universe. Stars fueled by nuclear fusion release unimaginable energy. This cosmic dance forges elements from carbon to iron. Black holes, engines of energy, influence galaxy evolution. Throughout history, humanity has sought to understand and harness the invisible forces of nature bending them to our will to power our civilizations and fuel our dreams. From the first campfires that illuminated the night and provided warmth to the sophisticated power grids that electrify our modern world, our mastery of energy has been a defining characteristic of our species. We've learned to exploit the energy stored in fossil fuels, harness the power of flowing water, and even tap into the immense energy locked within the atom itself. These technological advancements have brought about unprecedented progress, improving our lives in countless ways. But our reliance on fossil fuels has come at a cost, driving climate change and threatening the delicate balance of our planet's ecosystems. The challenge before us now is to transition to a more sustainable energy future, one that relies on renewable sources like solar, wind, geothermal and perhaps even fusion power, the holy grail of clean energy. As we stand at the precipice of a new energy era, the possibilities seem both daunting and exhilarating. Advances in nanotechnology, materials science and quantum physics hold the potential to revolutionize the way we generate, store and utilize energy. Imagine a world where energy is abundant and clean, where solar panels convert sunlight into electricity with near-perfect efficiency, where batteries store vast amounts of energy in compact and affordable packages, 
and where quantum computers design materials with unprecedented properties, enabling the development of room temperature superconductors and highly efficient energy storage devices. This energy utopia may seem like science fiction, but the seeds of its realization are being sown today in laboratories and research centers around the world. The journey ahead will require ingenuity, collaboration, and an unwavering commitment to a sustainable future. But the rewards, a cleaner, healthier, and more prosperous world for generations to come, are well worth the effort. From the smallest subatomic particle to the largest cosmic structure, energy orchestrates the universe's grand symphony. It's the driving force behind every process, every interaction, every transformation that shapes our reality. We've journeyed from the familiar states of matter solid, liquid and gas, to the exotic realms of plasma antimatter and even the hypothetical tachyons that could shatter the speed of light. We've explored the fundamental forces that govern the universe, gravity, electromagnetism, the strong and weak nuclear forces, and discovered how these forces manifest themselves as different forms of energy, from the heat of a fire to the electricity that powers our homes. We've peered into the heart of atoms, witnessing the dance of electrons and the release of energy from the atom's core. And we've gazed out at the cosmos, marveling at the energy of stars, galaxies, and even black holes, those enigmatic objects that warp the fabric of space-time. This journey through the realm of energy has been a testament to the interconnectedness of all things. We've seen how energy flows from one form to another, how it's created and destroyed, and how it binds the universe together in a delicate and intricate web. The study of energy is not merely an academic pursuit, it's a journey to the heart of what it means to be human, to inhabit this remarkable planet and to be part of something far grander than ourselves. It's a journey that reveals the unseen connections that bind us to the cosmos, to the very fabric of existence. When you feel the warmth of the sun on your skin, you're experiencing the energy of a star that has traveled millions of miles across space. When you switch on a light, you're tapping into a vast network of energy generation and distribution that spans continents. And when you marvel at the complexity of a living organism, you're witnessing the power of energy to create order from chaos to build and sustain life itself. Energy is the common thread that connects us all, a universal language that transcends the boundaries of culture, language, and even species. It's a language that speaks to our deepest curiosity, our innate desire to understand the world around us and our place within it. As we look to the future, the study of energy takes on even greater significance. We face unprecedented challenges, climate change, resource depletion, and the growing demand for energy in a rapidly developing world. But within these challenges lie opportunities, opportunities to innovate, to create, and to build a more sustainable and prosperous future for all. The universe is awash in energy, from the sun's inexhaustible rays to the wind that sweeps across our planet to the heat deep within the Earth's core. The challenge before us is to harness these abundant sources of energy in ways that are both efficient and environmentally responsible. We need to develop new technologies for capturing, storing and distributing energy. We need to rethink our transportation systems, our buildings and our entire approach to energy consumption. And we need to inspire a new generation of scientists, engineers and entrepreneurs to tackle these challenges with passion, creativity and a shared sense of purpose. The journey of energy is ultimately a journey of human potential. It's a journey that demands the best of our ingenuity, our compassion and our determination to create a better world. It's a journey that calls upon us to embrace our interconnectedness, to recognize our responsibility to each other and to the planet we share, and to strive for a future where energy is a source of prosperity, not conflict, of sustainability, not depletion, and of hope, not despair. The energy that powers the universe also flows through each of us. It's the energy of our thoughts, our dreams and our actions. It's the energy that drives us to explore, to create and to make a difference in the world. And it's this energy, ultimately, that will determine our destiny as individuals, as a species and as citizens of this remarkable planet we call home. Let us harness the power of energy wisely, compassionately and with a shared vision for a brighter future. The journey ahead is long, but the destination is well worth the effort. For in the end, the journey of energy is the journey of humanity itself.